welcome back to another video. If you're new to the channel, then my name is Jason, AK Humbo. Now, I've got a very special uh, video for you today. We're going on a journey. We're going on a high speed bullet train, and I have a first class ticket. Uh, so I'm very excited. We are just waiting in the train station now. I'm waiting for a train. So let's take this amazing high speed bullet train journey together. Let's begin. So if you're a rotund fellow, then you don't have any trouble. You've got space for your baggage and your case on top there. It's pretty nice. There's a look down the corridor. Oh, they have like a glass door here. I believe it's automatic. Oh, look at that. I must say, it's quite lovely. Oh, we have the uh, snacks. Uh, the snacks coming down here. You can buy all the snacks on the uh, train. Let's continue and look at, take a walk down the uh, carriage. So this is, uh, this is the uh, normal, normal class. I don't know what, I don't know what do you uh, call it? Economy class, I think. Oh, I'm just behind the cleaner. Anyway. So you have a s three seats and then two on this side. It's still pretty nice, to be honest. Let's do the how smooth is the train test. We're in a tunnel. Oh, you can still see. Now, I don't have a coin. Usually, you've got a coin here. Uh, but actually, who has coins these days? You know? <laughs> I don't have a coin. So, we can do it with the water. Just look at that. We're traveling at over 300 kilometers per hour. The water is barely even moving. That is just crazy. Busier down this end of the train. Just have an apple there. Playing poker. I saw a lot of people playing poker. Swadoin. Oh, another poker there. A lot of swadoin. A lot of swadoin. I wonder if we can catch anyone checking my channel. <laughs> well, that would be funny if someone's right on my channel and then I just appear behind their <laughs> appear, <laughs> appear behind their shoulder. Oh, some kind of anime. Ooh, I just bumped into someone. Oh, look at the construction there. That is China's infrastructure right before your very eyes. Wow. Oh wow, it's workers day. <laughs> this is the uh, business class here. These are business class tickets. Unfortunately, I don't have a business class ticket. So I'll just sit down for a second and enjoy this uh, business class. But I think the attendant is going to come 
is quite nice. Back to the uh, standard class here. Let's try out a uh, standard class seat. They are much narrower than the first class and business class. But I do believe the seat goes back. Ah, it does go back. Oh, that's pretty good. Well, it goes back quite far. Um, pretty comfortable. You do get good leg room too. Let's continue. One of the best things about traveling on the train is that when you book the ticket online, you don't need to pick up any ticket or you don't even need to show an e-ticket. You just turn up with what you booked with, your passport, that's why it's linked directly to your passport. It's crazy, you don't, it's so easy to just turn up at the train station and they just swipe your passport. You don't have to queue to pick up a ticket. By the way, is currently going at over 300 kilometers per hour. China, as you know, has the world's largest high-speed rail network and the most extensively used. Currently, their track is at, uh, I think it's at over 40,000 kilometers. And uh, they're still building, still. There's more track coming. It's crazy. I completely forgot to tell you where I'm actually going. So I'm on this high-speed bullet train, first-class journey. It's gonna be five hours. And we're traveling from Guizhou province all the way to Sichuan province. But which city am I going to find out at the end of this video? through quite a lot of uh, tunnels obviously because we're going through uh, Guizhou province. Oh, there's another tunnel. Um, and I bought myself, bought myself a little beer, uh, Budweiser unfortunately, um, American beer. I was hoping for a snow or a Qingdao. So I'm gonna enjoy this little beer on this train journey. Got my snacks there. I also bought some other snacks in the train station. Let me show you what I have. This is actually one of my favorite Chinese snacks. One egg. Two eggs. Three eggs. Four eggs. I have one more, five eggs. So I have uh, five eggs to enjoy on this journey. Wow, look at that bridge there. Oh, we're going back into a tunnel. Just, we must have gone through like 50 tunnels. So many, it's crazy. We're literally going through mountains. Oh, we're back out again. We're back out, back out into the mountains. I think we might 
have left Guangzhou province. Ah, look at that. Oh, we're going back into the tunnel in three, two, one. And we're in the tunnel again. It's just crazy. Hey. Hey, the attendant put my chair back up. cases because your case is always with you you don't have to get off and, like on a flight you have to wait for your luggage and check it in and all this on here case is right above my head it's way more convenient and look, look at the size look at i know this is a first class seat but i mean look at the size of this seat i'm fully stretched out and i'm you know <laughs> I'm a tall guy. <laughs> I'm over six foot, you know. I'm, I'm 185 centimeters tall. <laughs> this beer's a little bit strong. I've gone to my head. Ah, what a lovely train journey. And still, no one has come. So I've had these both these scenes. <sighs> Thinking about sneaking back into business class, aka Western first class, because it looks amazing. And and I still I still haven't bought a business class ticket. I can't believe it. Next time we're definitely gonna be going in business class. Well, I've just snuck back into, uh, I've snuck back into first class. Actually, the attendant said I'm allowed to uh, come here for a second. Uh, uh, has these kind of like egg chills. They look like amazing. You get your own TV or something. Oh, let's look outside. We 
have arrived that is the end of our journey actually um i wanted to last longer it was about five hours and it was quite comfortable indeed okay so that was a first class high speed bullet train from Panjo in Guizhou to Sichuan province and I can now reveal where have we come to? we have come to Chengdu we're in Chengdu city okay so that is the end of this video and I will see you in the next one signing off signing off